What's up guys? This is Wyvern. Um, I'm just going to be doing a short tutorial, it's not very good, about how to make a smoke bomb as the mission turn-in for Ground Zero. So, I'm just gonna jump right into it. So to the right here, we've got some, about, well, 6 grams of potassium nitrate. And to the left, about 4 grams of white sugar. So, I'm stirring it now, trying to get it to caramelize. And so I'm just going to skip through this to the part where it is caramelized and hardened. Okay, so now I've got it here, and it's real, it's still warm, but it's hardening pretty quick. And as you can see, I can, uh, it's still, uh, I got pretty bit, pretty nice hard chunks here. So, yeah. So, I'm gonna see if I can use a match. I'm gonna try and use a match here too, as the uh, ignition. Well, fuse, and I'm gonna take a few chunks away for a uh, idea I have about a. Um, a possible alternative in making a impact smoke bomb. So I'll just set off this, set that aside. And I'm gonna wrap this up now. Ah, it's still hot. Okay. So, it's not very pretty, but, you know, it should get the job done. So, yeah, I'm going to let this fully harden, and then take it outside and light it up. Okay, yeah, I know this is not much of a to to <coughs> tutorial, really, but, uh... This is really my first time making this, so all I used was the potassium nitrate, a uh, sh some sugar, a match and foil, obviously, but a stove, a pan. Oh, note to self: but guys, don't use plastic spatulas; they do not work well with heat. I should have known that, but you know. Whatever. So, I used a frying pan, but you better wash that quick it's with hot water if you plan on using it for anything else. So, yeah. My first attempt and at both a smoke bomb and a tutorial. So. Whoa! <laughs> now that is a smoke bomb. 